I got a job for you. So I kind of inspired a cult? And not the fun, ask you for autographs kind. I need you to infiltrate the children of the Firehawk and find out if they're planning anything shady. I'd do it myself, but I'm kind of worried they'd freak out if they saw their god in person. Go talk to the cult's leader, Incinerator Clayton. Hello everybody, and welcome back to Borderlands 2 Mission by Mission. As you can see, today we are doing Cult Following Eternal Flame. So, let's go find out about this cult. Uh, what are you doing? Are you buying ammo? Alright. Uh, actually I'm comparing my guns right now. <laughs> Okay, well, let's get on with it. Frostburn Canyon, yep. here we go. Stop boring everyone to death without with us just screwing with the golden keys. Well, it's not screwing with the golden keys. It's an essential equipment upgrade. I suppose everyone has to see it sooner or later. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's, it's inevitable that we're eventually going to have to start using our golden keys. Well, you don't have to. The, um, but it really helps. It, it does help, and it's nice, and it's a great thing. For those of you who don't know what the golden keys are or how they work, uh, first step is you sign up for a, um, a shift account, and there's a lot of social media stuff like um, the Borderlands Twitter feeds, the Twitter feeds for the developers, their Facebook page, all that stuff. You go to one of those pages, those pages, follow it, like it, etc. Eventually, they'll just periodically um, mention out codes. new codes. You enter that in Borderlands, and you get golden keys. You go to that chest, and you get a whole bunch of really cool stuff. And some some really crappy stuff. Yeah, and a lot of crappy stuff too. It's kind of hit and miss. There's a lot of superstitions. Because they give you five at a piece. You know, it's not so yeah. bad. There's a lot of superstitions about when you open it, like if when Claptrap is as close as possible, it gives you better loot. But honestly, it feels like it's about the same as holding the A button when you throw a Pokeball. It's like, it, it's a great superstition, it makes you feel better, but it doesn't do anything, I think. Oh, well. I am Incinerator what? Clayton, and you. I witnessed you enter the lair of the Firehawk and return unharmed. If you truly wish to serve our mother, you must pass a test. Use a fire weapon to send my brothers to the eternal plane! That you have a fire weapon, right? That pistol? Return them to me. Huh. Burning people alive is mildly shady, but these cultists sound like they want it. Which is weird. Do what he asks, I guess. <laughs> okay, well, my sniper- I have an entire combat to dedicated to burning myself alive to hurt the enemy. My sniper rifle is fire, so if I can everything except my shotgun is fire. Crap! He resists. Of course he resists. Uh, I'm gonna switch to an explosive just to weaken him. Oops. You might want to whittle them down with a non-elemental gun, then switch to a fire weapon to finish them off. There we go. I'm getting the other nomad right now. There's too many pyros. Can you kill the um the one no, the other direction. Behind you, behind you, behind you. Behind you. It was one with like a sliver of health and you were running away from him. Okay, am I, I am out of fire ammo. These guys are being assholes. Bring me more! 
ashes, just like that. All right, so it's gonna be up to you to kill them off. I killed one. With, I killed one off the deck. I fucking killed him. Resist fire. You should beat the tar out of them with a non-fire weapon. Yes, we got then that. Switch to a fire what is more beautiful than a handful of ashes? Remember. Okay, I've got some ammo again. Fire, you should beat the tar out of them with a non-fire weapon, then switch to a fire yeah. weapon for the last Little time. shut up. Okay. Uh. He's just trying to help. <laughs> Those guys resist fire. You should beat the tar out of them with a non-fire weapon. Then the fire okay, weapon hang on. the last few shots. Oh. Alright, let's keep this going. There we go. Killed a Goliath with a fire weapon. Nope. Oh boy. That is enough, my lanterns. I can feel the firehawk smiling upon us. Return the ashes to me! Just like that. My flesh is forever! He looks kind of... I don't know... ...amused to me. Well, these guys are pretty weird. You mean, weird by humans by our standards or by Pandoran standards? Even by Pandora standards, they're weird. But here we go. There's a lot. Okay, that's been Cult Following Eternal Flame. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye, everyone. That was anti-climatic. Oh, shut up! I don't know an ecstasy I can only dream of! Thank you!